So developed as usual. Develop the night through. Okay, just having a look at this gauge bar, see what's developing. Brought the knight back as usual. Wanted to see what the bishop wanted to do. So we don't do anything special or out of the ordinary. Um, we we are using the special knowledge of the answer, which is keeping things simple. So that's why it doesn't look anything special or out of the ordinary. But if you're not using the special answer process, then you may think that it is special. So we're attacking the bishop and we're focused on this pawn here because he's putting like two on ones on there. Wants to get rid of our bishop but uh, we like our bishop now so then we support the pot bishop. We knew the queen was coming down attacking the knight so then we put double on. So we're not losing any favour by doing those particular moves. Captures and does not like the pawn capture. Let's have a question on that. Doesn't like the pawn capture. Is it more the queen capture? Let me see. Well, the queen capture was better than the pawn capture. And the bishop capture was better than the queen capture, I think. Right, so the bishop should have captured. Although I didn't want my... I didn't want his queen really coming all the way through here. Interesting. Why is it saying the bishop? Bishop, because it's still got the diagonal towards the king, maybe? And it's also attacking this pawn. Hmm. Okay, we captured with the pawn. Definitely does not like that. In my head, I'm blocking this pawn from moving down. This bishop doesn't have any activity. Taking with the bishop would, in my eyes, it's opening up this line for the queen. Why would it say that? Anyway, questions. Right, so then they captured. And we captured. They brought their queen into the mix all by itself. So we captured. So black is winning here. And do, 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 I think they're a pawn up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, not at this stage. So the queen moves. We know the target in this area. So black is, oh, out and out winning. What did I do wrong? Whoa, I thought that was a good protection. We can't take, can we? No, what, what did we do wrong? Because it doesn't like their knight move. Maybe they were supposed to, no, maybe not that. Well, I don't know what is it a simple pawn move? No. Is it that move? No. Did the knight go the wrong way? No. Well, I don't understand that. Don't tell me it's a king move. Rook? Huh? Well, I don't know. Anyway, they made the wrong move, and I can't find the move that it just thinks it would be. Okay, so then that was not a good move. So now we can challenge the knight. So that's where we took the win. But for the life of me, what is this insane? No, it went back further, back further, back there. So my queen moved to there. Ah! <gasps> ah! Oh, that's so sad. That is so sad. My gosh, I had to find it because that's a massive job, and it's because I've moved the queen up, and then he could have just taken our rook, and they didn't. Oh, that's bad. That's so bad. Oh, Jamal, eh? All because we wanted to protect this pawn. 
Ooh. So I probably would have been doing that, but it's still not a good thing. Oof, 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 oof. Ouch. No, I'm not happy with that. Not happy with that at all. Right, so the opponent missed their golden opportunity. And then from that point on, we we look like we have the advantage here. I don't think there's any major dips now. We'll just have a look at this position here. Okay, so it is dropping a bit. Yeah, I was getting a bit of a flap really because it's like it's got all these pawns and the knight, and my rook's not doing anything. All he needs to do is start bringing his king down, and then it's all over. But we still got an advantage, but it's like it's a slow. Oh, look at that! It's almost drawish now. Look at that! And then they make the move. They they panic themselves. So it opens up the space. It helps us win a tempo. So we start making our way around the back. no major dips there yeah so from the opponent's minor oversight of being able to take our rook and our own oversight the fact that i didn't even see that he could do that oh these are things that help us develop our games Whew. ten minute game okay let's attack this weak pawn let's grab it Oh, we're back into this position. I don't like it. It's no good, but it, it's there. It's there. I still can't fashion anything else that helps it. But uh, so it's going to castle quicker. Let's castle. Okay, so he's trying to do something. He wants this pawn. So pawn pushing. You know, it's a. Uh, could go here, I've got two on one, but he's got two on one there, so I may as well just reverse it back. It's pretty similar to one of the other games we've had. Let's see what the bishop wants to do. Coming down all huffy and puffy like that. We could develop our own bishop, just attacking through x ray and x ray and x ray. And last but not least, the pawn attacking the bishop. Now he's got like a 2 on 1 here, so we need to be mindful of that. Just bring the rook here. It's all delicate. It's a lot of dancing, but um, I'm, I'm not dancing. I'm, I'm appropriately targeting. The opponent is dancing, they're bobbing and weaving, and there's nothing definite being done. So we could take the knight. Gives him the diagonal. I like my bishop. Let's bring it back. So I think we're going to see a, some sort of non-move now. So they've gone for the long pause. Oh, he's coming for the pawn. Oh, bless him. So we could attack the queen. Queen attacks. I may as well just do this though. Comes down for the knight because the knight's got no protection on it. Probably seems like a bit of a waste of a move going to attack so if we attack the knight it does have a two on one with his bishop and so so the knight could take but we could take his knight bishop with a check on his king so we're attacking two pieces the bishop and the queen so it's actually taken okay so what we can do is take here the rook is on the bishop so the bishop probably is going to take our net bishop yep Okay, so we just grab here, attacking his bishop. It's probably going to bring it back because he's thinking, whoa, no, oh, he hasn't. So this queen maneuver is attacking this pawn here. 
So he's got this paw, if we grab here, so we're attacking his rook, he grabs here, we take his rook, then his queen is here in front of our king, but then our queen would take his queen. So I'm going to take the bishop. decides that it's no good doing that so now just basically attacking the queen with the support from the pawn it's probably flying up here to attack this area Yep, so bring the queen here now so we've got protection and then we can bring this rook here as well to support and could just take this knight off the ball but he's actually, um, he could come here putting a check on the king, can take the bishop, doubles the pawns, queen takes, hmm, am I too concerned, rook could just simply take, <laughs> pawn takes. Shall we go here or here? Let's go here. Keep it simple. Because we know that's what they're targeting. If he takes, we take. That's no problems. Ah, well, okay. Let's see what he wants to do. Let's take this rook. This might be a fancy knight maneuver I've missed, but uh, we'll see. So it doesn't have to take because obviously you can just stay there. I don't think the queen's going to take because I'll get taken, so. Does he come and try and attack the, the rook? Oh, he's got a check on me. What's all that about? Oh, that's disappointing. Well, I suppose I can just move counter. Not in the line of fire of his knight, though. Yeah. Well, let's get a check on the king first. And let's um if we take things take for a moment there I thought he had a fork on the rook as well. And got to watch. It's looking for safety here. So if he goes there, we go here. And does he still have a fork again? Here's a fork on my king again. Yeah. Well, not a fork, but oh, and the pawn. Would you add them and eat it? Oh, and the other pawn as well. Jeez. Damn. Oh, don't let him take all the pawns now with this knight. No, this can't happen. Oh, give me strength.
need to dishevel this pawn structure he's got going on here. He's just got one too many pawns on this side. What's that? to get my king here he's going to be wanting to he's chomping at the bit to get this 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 and all this sort of stuff and I need to well I don't need to just get it just here do I no forks please it's got a fork on my rook, but that's about it, isn't it? As so it goes here. And we can go here. It's coming down. Okay, careful, careful. Ooh, look at that. Damn, I can't even take the pawn because he's got that. So I'm going to have to do this first. Gonna take this pawn. So if we go one, which pawn is the danger? If we go one, he takes, we take. Right, let's try that. more active than just sitting there with the rook and oh he's not taken Let's just grab it Let's grab that if we come here he takes I think I was glad that I did that manoeuvre going around the back. We've got rid of the poor majority. Just he hasn't got a fork on me. He can attack me here. I take the pawn. Then he comes for this pawn here. It's taken. Oh, before I move. Any forks in there? Yep, so Okay, that'll do. Right, let's grab here. Let's grab that. Oh, he's asked for a tape back. I don't think so. <laughs> Should have taken your time. We had three minutes there. So I think, yeah, definitely glad that we paused. Oh, they've left the game. Okay, I'll wait for the time to run out and then we'll have a look at the analysis quickly on that one.